Hi, my name is Anita DuBose and I developed the BCDR Link web service for Unitrends. Today I will be giving you a demo of the Unitrends BCDR Link web service. BCDR stands for Business Continuity and Disaster Recovery. BCDR Link is a free web service that allows you to modify an industry standard business continuity and disaster recovery template for your company or organization. The template was created by a Unitrends credentialed BC expert specifically for the BCDR Link service. Once you make this plan suit your company, you store it permanently in the Unitrends cloud. You can modify your company's stored plan, share the plan with others in your organization, and most importantly, access it for your response when and if you have a business disruption. The BCDR Link is simple. There is nothing to download, there is no setup, and there is no configuration. You open your free account and immediately get started with your BCDR plan. The free BCDR link service will always be free. You will never be charged for accessing or storing your BCDR plan. Unitrends may add fee-based services around the BCDR link website in the future, such as a charge for additional storage or for testing your disaster recovery backups, but Unitrends is firmly committed to retaining your stored plan as free forever. The goal here is to facilitate more organizations having a BCDR plan by making it very easy to get started. Statistics show that too many organizations do not have any BCDR plan at all. If they do, it is often scattered on various hard drives around the company that could too easily be down also in a disaster. Because the Unitrends line of products are designed for backup, recovery, and replication, both on-premise and in the cloud, Unitrends knows firsthand the importance of adequate BCDR planning. We have many years of experience in assisting users in critical outage situations. The BCDR Link service has grown out of this recognition of user needs and our professional experience with urgent response. The Unitrends Cloud meets the highest standards of global, worldwide availability, security, and privacy, and is managed by our Unitrends professionals in DR and BC operations. Here's how you get started with the BCDR Link free service. You can access the free BCDR Link service in a number of ways. From the Unitrends website, the way I am here, from links and emails or other communications, or you can go to www.bcdrlink.com directly. When you use any of these access points, you reach the BCDR Link website homepage. You have two choices here. You can sign up for the service if you have not previously signed up, or you can log in if you have already signed up. I'm going to click on sign up and complete a registration. The registration works similarly to most website registrations. You use an email address as a login and complete profile information about your company. When you do this sign up, you are opening your free company account at BCDR Link for your company's business continuity and disaster recovery plan. After you fill out the sign up form, you receive an email at the address you entered in the form and need to click on the link in the email to return to BCDR Link to activate your account. I'm going to jump past getting that email and start here in BCDR Link with the registration already completed. At this point, I would click on this first button to view or edit the BCDR plan to customize it for my company. My demo company is a home health care organization called Confluence Care. I clicked on the View Edit and I'm looking at the first page of the template. The template is designed for all businesses or organizations such as banks, advertising agencies, retail chains, educational institutions, governments, healthcare organizations such as this one, really any type of business. Managed service providers and hosters would find this plan particularly useful for their clients. The plan works for any sized business from enterprise to very small, and if needed you can have separate plans for departments or business units within a business. And the plan is based on the latest ISO, DR, and BC standards in case you are in a regulated or audited industry. A business continuity consultant would charge your business a high fee just to provide an industry standard template such as this one. The plan always displays in the middle window for quick viewing or editing, and the table of contents is on the left pane, allowing you to jump quickly to the section you need. The sections represent the best practices for all types of information collected in case of a business disruption. So you see a technology support information section, a contact list for emergency response team members, 
All of this you would need if your data center went down. You probably have on hand your backup schedule and the recovery time objectives of your restores from backup. You can insert these schedules right into your plan. But you also see sections for media and communication plans in case your disaster affects your business's reputation and you need to have a PR campaign mobilized quickly. If you have some sort of security breach at your business, you see a section for legal actions and for escalation. There are 19 chapters and 19 appendices that can accommodate any information specific to protecting your business. The template can be modified for My Confluence Care Business, so I'm going to click on Edit. The template has a full word processing style editor with a familiar ribbon toolbar that contains many editing tools. You can delete, change text, add tables, add colors, fonts, highlighting, and cut, copy, and paste. You can insert other files such as graphics, and this is how you would brand your template with your company's logo. I'm going to show you how you would insert your company logo. I previously uploaded the Confluence Care logo to my stored files. I will show you the way to store these files a little later in this demo. Other files you might insert are your insurance policies, such as flood or fire, your evacuation diagram, your backup retention schedule, or your critical vendor supply list. As part of our free service, each company can store up to one gigabyte of documents. This storage is intended to be for disaster recovery information, such as runbooks for the IT data center, or as I mentioned, insurance or evacuation plans. It is not intended to be a backup data repository for your backup files from computers or servers. This type of backup storage is offered by several other Unitrends products, such as the Unitrends Recovery Series Appliances, the Disaster Recovery as a Service, and by its CloudHook feature. There is a full help file that is linked to the chapter you are on. When you are on a chapter of the plan, the help that displays is for that chapter. Here is the help for the chapter we are on now. You have two options for printing your BCDR plan based on the typical use cases for handling disaster recovery operations. You can print just the chapter or section of the plan you are on. You might do this to give a department its separate disaster recovery information. Or you can go to the button on the top level to print the entire plan. Printing the full plan is recommended to distribute the whole plan to your emergency response team so that they always have a hard copy of the plan at home or in their car. The plan can be viewed and even edited from a smart device, although the intention with a smart device is to primarily view your plan. A smart device or smartphone is how you would access your plan if you truly had a disaster and employees could not reach their computer or desk. As I am modifying the plan, I probably can see right away that I might not have all the information on hand. Because your plan is permanently stored in the Unitrends cloud, you can save your plan at any time and re-access it with your login and password. You might also recognize that you are not the right person to provide some of the information, but others at your company are, or even perhaps some external consultants are. This is when you go to your homepage and invite others to access your plan. I am going to my homepage and click on Manage Users to share my plan with others. I click on Add User and can add one or more names and can add them as either administrators or as view only users. An administrator invited to my plan can do everything I can do with the plan, such as edit, delete, insert files, and access the one gigabyte of free storage I mentioned earlier. An invited administrator can also invite other administrators just in case they are not the right person with the information, but someone else they know is. There are no limits to how many you can invite. If you invite a view-only user, they can only see the plan and print it. They cannot change the plan and they cannot invite others. View-only users would be employees at your company who need to know what to do in a disaster, but who are not in management or not on the business continuity team and should not be changing the BCDR plan. The last feature I want to show you is the Manage Files function. I'm going back to my home screen and clicking on the Manage Files button. This works just like the insert file that we already saw when we were editing the plan. You can insert a file directly into your plan, which is what we did when we inserted the company logo. This makes the file viewed within the plan itself. Or you can simply store additional documents or pictures using this Manage Files button. Files added this way are not viewable within the plan itself. They are more like attachments, but can be uploaded and downloaded separately to view or edit. 
The intention of Manage Files is to provide a convenient central location of all documents related to BC and DR in an off-site location in case of a disaster. It is not intended to be the general type of cloud storage where you copy your entire computer drive up to the cloud to protect it. As mentioned, Unitrends does offer this type of disaster protection in other Unitrends solutions. But BCDR Link is a unique and specialized service for centralizing and storing information related to business continuity for your company. If you already have a completed disaster recovery plan, you can simply upload it here in its entirety and not bother with completing the template at all. All administrator users can add files or delete them when the files are outdated or no longer necessary. They can also overwrite files with newer versions. After you create your plan, you may need to look at it only once or twice a year to keep it updated as your company information changes. You would also want to use your stored BCDR plan when conducting a tabletop DR simulation or when running a DR test. Your BCDR plan is permanently, privately, and securely stored in the Unitrends cloud. If you have a disaster, your plan is waiting to be the response action plan and communication mechanism for your company in its time of need. This completes our demo of the free BCDR link service. Thank you for taking the steps necessary to protect your company, no matter what your future holds.